guys, today I'm going to be talking about rotation, and rotation is kind of upon us. I make this video almost every single time my set is going to rotate. Obviously, the set that's rotating is Born of the Gods, Journey into Nyx, and Pharos. So, the green one, the purple one, and the red one, as I call them. And it is going to be a very interesting time period, because unlike RTR, RTR is very simple. You knew what to pick up. Abrupt Decays. Shocklands, Voice of Resurgence, uh, Death Rite Shamans before they were banned, Revelations were a maybe pick up, Loxygen Smiter, I mean they were cards at all price points. So even if you had two dollars and you wanted to speculate on card, you could pick one. And this is not true with this particular rotation. This rotation, there's not many good cards. I mean there's really not that many good cards. Uh, with the last rotation, RTR, you had the 10 shock lands, so if nothing else, you could speculate on the shock lands and you would be long term fine. But right now, you are, I'm concerned that there's not enough speculation targets, and because there's not enough speculation targets, the price of those targets, the ones that are really good, we all know that Thought Sees is very good. Like, that's not even like a target. I would not surprise me if that went down like a few dollars and then just kept steady, because that's one of the main speculations uh, for the rotation. Next, you have the Skylands, which I don't think are good enough to speculate on. And you have Brimaz. Brimaz just doesn't have a home. Um, he doesn't have a home. It's a very strong card. Like Voice of Resurgence, but Voice found a home. And he found one while he was dominating Standard. Brimaz never dominated Standard. People made decks so they can play Voice. Not the same with Brimaz. Brimaz was mostly just, for me at least, a Mardu filler card. So not great. Not great at all. And I mean, you look at what's in these sets, you do have the gods and they are casual cards. Uh, out of all the gods, I like Aethrios, the black white god, the best because of how little it costs. Uh, there's also the Merfolk one, Vasa. She is also not bad. But then the other eight gods, I'm just like, eh, you know. I guess, right? Whip of Erebos is not really a speculation. I mean, when you look at the whole, rot what's rotating out, there's not many good cards rotating out. Um, I would say Call of Cording, or Cord of Calling might be interesting, Orgbog. But those cards are already like, um, Orgbot especially, I don't think it's gonna drop in price that much because of the EDH play sees. Very good card, but it's only a one of. It's not a four of. So it's not like we're talking about abrupt decays where it's just a dominant in every format. This current rotation outside of Dot Seas, there's not too many cards I'm too excited to pick up on. And when give you an example, RTR, I picked up so many of them, and the cards. I mean, there was these ten shock lands. There was Death Rite Shaman. At the time, uh, there was Jace AOT actually was an interesting pickup. Frasca, um, Abrupt Decay, what else? I picked up a ton of Boros Charms. Even at Uncommon, you had Boros Charms. I can't even name one Uncommon from uh, Skullcrack, was also very good in Gatecrash. I mean, there's so many good cards in that set. And that block, um, Mutavolt, Mutavolt obviously was very good. It's going to be even better now. And the block before that, you had Huntmaster, you had Falia, you had Liliana, you had Snapcaster, you had uh, Olivia Vodaren, you had uh, Delver of Secrets, all those angels, Avacyn, Grizzlebrand. I don't see that. I don't see it for this rotation. So I might not even get myself in this rotation because I, I normally buy quite a bit during rotation. But this particular one I'm not excited at all about. Like I, there's not outside of thought sees call cord of calling. There's not very much I would be excited about or I really should be excited about. So overall like it's kind of meant to me this rotation will probably just um I'm too lazy to sell the cards I currently have. So yeah. Bye guys.